You probably know him best as Loras Terrell on HBO's hit show Game of Thrones, but Finn Jones has just been cast as Marvel superhero Iron Fist. I've had some really enjoyable fun chats with Finn about his work on Game of Thrones and you can check those out right here. But how much do you really know about the British actor taking on the lead role of Danny Rand in the upcoming Iron Fist series on Netflix? I'm Jan and this is 7 Things You Need To Know About Finn Jones. Finn got his first on-screen acting break in 2009 straight out of drama school. Yes, after three years studying at Arts Ed, a performing arts school in London, Finn bagged himself an agent as soon as he graduated, and within a few weeks landed his first job, a recurring role playing a drug dealer called Jamie on the British soap opera Hollyoaks. Roles followed on shows including the BBC children's series The Sarah Jane Adventures, a spin-off from Doctor Who. Finn appeared in two episodes playing Santiago Jones, the grandson of Joe Grant, who was a Doctor's companion in the early 1970s show. Before he was cast, Finn had never watched an episode of Doctor Who and didn't even know what a TARDIS was. But as soon as he got the part, he did his research and had a fantastic time filming. Of course, Finn's best known for playing the Knight of Flowers, Sir Loras Terrell, lover of the late Renly Baratheon and brother of Marjorie Terrell on the mega TV phenomenon Game of Thrones, but he originally auditioned for the role of Jon Snow. As well as learning to ride a horse for the show, after being cast, Finn also read George R. R. Martin's A Song of Ice and Fire novels from which the show's adapted. Not only does he love the books now, but he also enjoys geeking out on theories about the series with his co-stars and fans at conventions. Finn is a huge fan of the Cartoon Network's TV series Adventure Time about a boy named Finn and a dog named Jake. In fact, he's such a big fan that he even got to sit in on a live recording of an episode, with its star Jeremy Shida, who's the voice of Finn on the popular animated show. Finn's described himself as a huge obsessive lover of music, and he's actually been DJing professionally for a couple of years now. He credits his Game of Thrones co-star fellow DJ and friend Christian Nern, who plays Hodor on the show, with introducing him to the world of touring as a DJ. But even before that, Finn loved DJing at home or at parties with his friends. Music-wise, Finn's a fan of house, techno and disco. Finn says he loves horror movies, particularly director Wes Craven's late 1980s horror The Serpent and the Rainbow starring Bill Pullman. In fact, the Game of Thrones star has appeared in a number of horror movies himself, including Leatherface, which is a prequel to the Texas Chainsaw Massacre, and The Last Showing, in which he co-starred with horror icon Robert Englund, aka Freddy Krueger. Indeed, when I last interviewed Robert Englund, he described Finn as a cross between the late Heath Ledger and Orlando Bloom. Finn's original name is actually Terence or Terry Jones, but he changed his stage name to Finn to avoid being confused with Monty Python star Terry Jones. The inspiration for the name Finn came from the character Huckleberry Finn created by author Mark Twain. So guys, what do you think about Finn Jones as Iron Fist? And if you're a fan of Game of Thrones, what would you like to see Loras do next on the show? I'd love to hear your thoughts in the comments below. I really appreciate all your likes, shares and comments, and if you enjoyed this, why not check out some of my other videos, including 10 things you probably didn't know about The Flash, Daredevil Season 2 Easter Eggs, and my Game of Thrones playlist, with interviews with the cast and my Season 6 predictions. Thanks for watching and see you next time, yibikaye TV lovers!